Bonjour, hello, and welcome to my channel, Sarah Sear Tarot. I'm here today to do a reading for Cancer. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Cross watchers, you are also welcome here. Spirits, ancestors, and guides, please guide me today to provide a message for Cancer. Also light a candle for the ancestors so that they may deliver the message that needs to be heard. Cancer. What is going on with you, Cancer? What message needs to come out at this time? Ooh, some kind of shock. The Lady of Lightning. Surprises, sometimes shock. Total paradigm shift. There is lightning is also Wasese in Ojibwe. Okay, the next card we get is the Cosmos. Creativity, vastness. Hmm. Maybe you're thinking up some new creative thing that you're going to do. And then we have the Hawk Prince. Spirit communication, paying attention. I can hear the birds outside, some kind of chitter chatter in the background. Maybe you're needing to listen to something. And then, then we get the sun dancers. This is a happiness card. There's a doorway in the back, dancing with your wings, joyful activity, celebration of life, abundance. So whatever this big change, this some surprise, sometimes shock, total paradigm shift, looks like it's leading to something creative that is going to bring in some type of joyful activity and abundance. It's very exciting. And spirit is communicating with you at this time, Cancer. Okay, let's going to use the Barbara Moore deck. See what's going on with Cancer. First three cards will be for you. The next three cards will be the situation. And the final three cards will be the outcome. What is going on with Cancer? Five of Wands, some kind of fight. Maybe it's a surprise fight. Some heavy burden, a new cycle beginning. And then we have here, the King of Cups, or the King of Pentacles, I'm sorry, which could have to do with your stability your money situation could be a earth sign that you an earth sign that you're dealing with Taurus Virgo Capricorn but there's some heavy burden cancer that you're laying down there's some fight and it has to do with this husband or your stability some type of money situation the situation you're dealing with is juggling money Juggling your pentacles, trying to come into balance about something. And you're waiting for your ships to come in. Maybe you're fighting about some type of 
money situation where you're having to juggle things all the time, Pisces. Oops, not Pisces, Cancer. You're waiting for your ships to come in and you're always having to juggle something around. And this heavy burden, you're getting in a fight with it, maybe with your husband. And the fool, you're ready for a new adventure, some kind of new direction, some new path, a leap of faith. You're tired of juggling your finances, this fighting. The outcome is the emperor. Maybe cancer, you're becoming your own boss. Could be dealing with a father figure. Having to put up your boundaries. And holding on to something too tightly. Your pentacles. Hmm. Cancer, I think you're in a fight about your stability right now. Because you've been having to juggle something, juggle money around. And you're waiting for something to come in. And this boss, you're having to put up boundaries with this boss who's been holding on to something too tightly. And you're putting up boundaries with this boss energy. And you're ready for a new path. Underneath the deck, you're dealing with a soulmate, somebody from your childhood, a childhood sweetheart, childhood friend, could be a pet. And there's some happiness here. Maybe a baby's on the way. And you're getting wise looking within about this situation. There's some type of shift that's going on right now, though, Cancer. Okay, Cancer, let's get some clarifying cards on this story that's unraveling. Cancer. Clarify why the Five of Wands is here. What is this fight? Six of Swords. This fight is wanting you to make, moving on to calmer waters. Maybe because you're laying down some heavy burden. There's some truth coming to light about some heavy burden cancer that you've been dealing with. What's this King of Pentacles here for? Ace of Cups. Your stability. Maybe there's some truth coming to light about a new love and you wanting to move on from this fighting energy, this heavy burden with a husband. Because you got new love. Or maybe you have cancer, this new love for an earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. The situation that's been going on looks like you there's some juggling going on with the third party this three of cups why is the three of wands here what is cancer waiting for it's three of wands which is also three weeks a timing card what are you waiting for you're waiting for some lying, cheating, sneaky behavior to be revealed about this juggling activity, this third party. Maybe you're dealing with an Aries that's been doing this. Cancer. You have a deep knowing using your intuition about this lying, cheating, sneaky behavior that's been going on while you've been waiting for something to happen, some ships to come in, some abundance or something. But you're using your intuition about this and knowing that there is a new direction, a new path you need to go on, Cancer. 
you're moving on to calmer waters from this fighting energy. Some kind of surprise or shock is coming in. And you're paying attention using your intuition. What's the outcome? What's the outcome for cancer? The emperor here, this boss, has been causing you anxiety. Sleepless nights, invading your peace, this fighting energy. Whoever your boss is, you're sick of it. Could be an Aries you're dealing with. And you're tired, tired of defending yourself. You want to move on. There's victory at hand. Moving away from something. Why is the Four of Pentacles here? A decision. There's this difficult decision you have to make and you're deep in your thoughts about it. I'm thinking that you're dealing with this decision on whether or not to move away to calmer waters from this fighting energy. You're facing this truth about this heavy burden that you've been carrying and then you know there needs to be a new cycle that starts. And you're thinking about your stability, your husband. Who is your husband going to be? Who is going to have your heart? Because you're, you realize the truth about this heavy burden. You're tired of this juggling that's been going on with money and this third party. There's been some sneaky behavior while you've been waiting for your ships to come in. And there's this deep intuition, this knowing that you have to take a leap of faith in another direction. This boss energy or this Aries that you're dealing with has been causing you such anxiety. In Cancer, you've had your boundaries up, but you're tired of defending yourself and you wanna move on, move towards victory. And you've been holding on to something for a long time and it's time to make that decision. And the King of Pentacles shows up again. The King of Pentacles is about stability, husband material, somebody that's very settled. And you have the Queen of Wands here getting your mojo back. And a deep knowing, the hermit, going deeply within. Remember underneath the deck on the other one was somebody from your childhood cancer. You know there's happiness that's involved, maybe children, grandchildren. And you have a deep knowing about this. You've been searching within. You're coming to the realization of some truth about Somebody from your childhood that is actually the person that you want to give your love, your heart, new love to. And whatever situation right now that you're in, this fighting, you know it's time to move to calmer waters. A surprise has come into light. While you've been waiting for your ships to come in, somebody's sneaking off. And it has to do with juggling this third party situation. And it's time for you to take that leap of faith. Use your intuition. You know what decision has to be made. Okay, Cancer. Let's look and see what kind of blocks you have going on, Cancer.
What kind of blocks do you have going on? Six of Wands. Two of Swords. There's that hard decision you have to make going towards some type of victory. Your victory is being blocked by this decision. Ah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Investments. What seeds you planted? Your victory and the seeds you planted, the victory for those seeds you planted, what you've invested your time in, you have to make it a decision about. That's what's been blocking you. What's the advice for cancer? Six of Cups, a soulmate. Temperance, you could be dealing with a Sagittarius. And justice, the law, a contract, karma. Hmm, something coming into balance. This is patience for something to come into balance with maybe a soul soulmate, somebody from your childhood. And it's finally here. There's some kind of justice that it's occurring, some kind of surprise, a shock. And you've been patiently waiting for this. Patient you've been, or you need to practice patience for this justice to happen. And it has to do with a soulmate. You got the soulmate card twice, Cancer. Okay, what else does Spirit want you to know? Nine of Cups. Knight of Cups and the Emperor. It's the second time you've gotten the Emperor card here. Which is either an Aries, a boss figure, or a father figure. But there's some kind of wish fulfillment going on. And there's a love offer. It looks like your wishes are going to be granted. This emperor is going to come in. Even though you've had anxiety about this divine masculine, this father figure, this boss. You've had your defenses up about how you move forward, how you control the light and the dark. This difficult decision of holding on to your pentacles, how you're going to invest your time. This emperor is coming forward with a nice love offer and you're gonna get your wishes granted. Underneath you have the King of Cups. Mature love. This could be you too, Cancer. It's a water sign, deep in your feelings, but you've mastered your feelings. And there's two kings here, Cancer. Husband material, mature love, mature in your stability, mature love going on here, Cancer. And it's a soulmate that you're dealing with. But there's some divine masculine that's coming through to offer you love and your wishes are granted. The advice is to practice some patience because something is prevailing. Justice, balance, the law, a contract, and it has to do with your soulmate. I hope that was helpful, Cancer. Bama P. See you later.